Many students at Rutgers North do not realize that Bradley Hall holds a gallery on the fifth floor where fine arts majors and creators alike can showcase their art throughout the year. Many students do not realize the gallery is even here and oftentimes the showcases are overlooked by students. This is a tough question because some people have different interpretations, but I think art is something with intention, something creative, something that speaks to people's emotions. A lot of people will argue art is subjective. Uh, a wise teacher of mine once told me, art is the universal language of humanity. And pretty much what artists do is they, they, they convey a message, whether it's graphic design or fine arts. Professor Emmanuel Cacciatore, a fine arts professor here at Rutgers North, held a painting and arts workshop for the fine arts majors, friends, and families, December 6th on the 5th floor of Bradley Hall. Even though the Paul Robeson Center is frequented daily, a vast majority of students don't realize the Nova Gallery inside has housed artists such as Bonnie Glorious, Ben Georgia, and Mark D'Augusto. According to the Nova Gallery's official website, the gallery's mission is to embody the lifelong commitment to artistic freedom, cultural democracy, as well as presenting art and culture that educates the diverse metropolitan context of Rutgers North. People think that art is, it doesn't matter, or that it's something that isn't for them, um, or that it belongs in a museum or a gallery and not on the streets. And because they don't feel like the art is made for them, then they don't really take the time to go and see what it is. They overlook art because they, they look at it and say, okay, well, a four-year-old could do this, or, yeah, it's great, you could draw, but what's that going to help us out in the real world? They don't realize that it's all over, and, like, I don't know, I just feel like it's not respected at all. Well, I think every university should have an art program, um, specifically what it does for Rutgers. Um, I would hope that it would expose students and people who aren't normally gallery-going people um, or museum attending people to go out and see what's around. Um, there's a lot of great art in New York and also just New York City is just a train right away. And even art students a lot of time don't go out and don't take the time to see that, to try to understand the history of um, visual culture. So I think that's really important. It's teaching that sort of literacy.